Okay, duplicating yourself is the last step in the 10-step pattern. You want to, a lot of people don't take it. It's kind of buried back there in the, in the 10 steps. And you want to make sure that you take this, take this step as serious as you take all the other steps because it's kind of the foundation for your, for your business as far as people building it in a manner that is going to be so simple and so duplicatable that your business can keep making can, can keep running even though you take a break one day from your business or like I said if you have a crisis or something happens in, in your with your family or you can't uh, do you can't work you get injured uh, your Monavie business is going to keep going unlike a job or a, or a profession many times or your own business this business can keep uh, running and making you an income for your family even though you're not there so what do I mean by duplicating yourself well, first thing you want to do is make sure you're doing the right things. If you're doing the three keys uh, within the R3 Global Support System, which is read, listen, participate, and you're promoting that in your group, then everyone else is doing the same thing, meaning that if you're on the R3 Glo the M3 program, which is the monthly motivation materials, then everyone else is doing the same thing you're doing. They're promoting the book that they got this month and the book on audio tape, and they're promoting the CD and the DVD that they got, and everyone else is listening to it and getting motivated and, and uh, being inspired and learning to be more relatable. Just like you're doing it, they're doing it, they're duplicating to the next person. That's the kind of habit that you want in your business. You want to make sure that people are participating at the open meetings, at the business building seminars, at the major conventions. If you're not going, then they're not going. If you're du Whatever you're doing, everyone is duplicating. So if you're creating bad habits like you're not reading, you're not listening, you're not showing up at these events, then they're not going to do the same thing. You're, going to you're not going to have anybody in your group at the major convention if you're not there. So if you're making that a priority and you're following the, uh, the, uh, the commitment uh, ladder that I talked about earlier, then everyone else is doing the same thing and you're going to see everyone doing the same thing that you're doing. If you're doing something that's not duplicatable, for instance, if you're doing something that's strange in the business, like going to uh, wellness fairs or trade shows, which is not in the 10-step pattern, people have already tried that, as a matter of fact, in my business, and it doesn't work. Tasting parties. If you're doing tasting parties that are duplicatable, are you talking for two hours at your tasting party? That's not duplicatable. If you're keeping it to 35 minutes and everyone signs up and they're out of the house within an hour, that's duplicatable. Uh, when you're having your tasting parties, are you serving shrimp and, and uh, <clears throat> all kinds of hors d'oeuvres? Well, when people come to your tasting party, they're probably saying, man, I don't think I could do that. I can't have a tasting party. If you're keeping it simple to water and Montevi, then everyone else can do that. That's what I mean by duplicating yourself. You want to keep it simple and, and, uh, and duplicatable like a, like a franchise would. When you, when you run a franchise, such as uh, any type of one, of the, one of the successful franchises, everything is the same when you go to order something at that franchise or you go to one of the stores, they're all the same. Same thing here in your Montevi business. You want everything to be the same so that you can be duplicated and you keep it fun and simple. Remember, we're not looking for a different tasting party or a different meeting. They're actually the same meetings. Your goal is just to keep putting more people in the seats. My upline is Charlie Kalb. He did a tasting party at my house. Well, when he did the next tasting party, it was the exact same tasting party. It wasn't a different tasting party, but there were, I had more people in the seats. I wasn't looking for another tasting party. I liked the first one he had. So other, you want to just make sure that it's the same and duplicatable, and you just keep filling seats, more people at the tasting party. Eventually, you'll be filling up hotel rooms. So keep it simple. Keep it fun. Duplicate yourself. Make sure you're do, doing, doing, following the 10-step pattern so you can have a successful Montevi business that can thrive when you step away from it. It's not all about you. You don't want to be the person that is motivating your team. You want to be duplicatable enough that everyone can run it whether you're there or not. Duplicate yourself.